The goal of Waypoint is to introduce people to activities like hiking, rock climbing, snowshoeing, show them that um, with supports or maybe no supports needed at all, they're able to participate in these activities close to home. And our niche is working with folks uh, with disabilities, so showing them that they're, they're able to participate in these activities. Um, the students participating tonight are a group of students coming from the Perkins School for the Blind. We like to show people that everybody can come together and be challenged and enjoy and participate in an activity um, and that we all bring something different to the table. I want you to think about the word challenge. What, is it, what does it mean to challenge yourself? Do you think you're going to be yeah. trying yeah. some new things, maybe doing something that you didn't think you would be able to do or that you wouldn't normally do? Yeah. yeah. I am working with all these students to help them enable themselves to empower themselves um, on their spring break. We had several students um, when we were first coming here that said, I don't want to do it, but I'll go along, and they're all doing it, and they've all succeeded. For the kids, I think they just want to see that they're capable of doing things, and that their disabilities, whatever they may be, does not get in the way. My favorite, my favorite part is climbing the wall. I had I had a hard time fighting the rock that that for my hand and with my feet. That was kind of challenging for me. Reach up with that left hand. There's one up there. It's just a little higher. There you go. Good. No, nope. keep the right hand where it was. Good. Now let's get the left foot up real high. There you go. Get your foot on there. It's a big one. Get that foot good and dug in. Nice. Now what I want you to do is take your left hand and touch something right in front of your face. There you go. You got it. You did it! Oh yeah! You did it! job of telling them to challenge themselves so in the future when they think that they can't do something maybe they'll think back to this experience and be like when I didn't think I could get to the top of that rock I did it so kind of inspire them to do things that they think are impossible. So tonight we have another group of students coming from Perkins School for the Blind and the goal is to teach four basic hiking skills so they'll be learning how to put on a life jacket get into the boat, um, a few paddle strokes, and then what to do if their boat flips over. Maybe some of them can't even swim. You know, they start off and uh, you know, each person has like a different amount of, uh, you know, where you're gonna put your goals at. Like some people, it's, they're gonna get in, they're gonna try to do a wet exit, like flip over and get out of the boat. Another person, like their like their Everest is just like just to touch a boat. It's like really fun in the water, and you could flip over at any time, which is my favorite part. You have to make sure you tuck your head in near your knees so that you don't like bump your head or anything. I can do just about anything if I set my mind to it. I realized, yeah, that I could do this myself, and because. I don't know, just because people at school, they, they, use, they like do things for me, like even though I tell them, no, I'm capable of doing this, they still don't listen to me. But yeah, I don't know, I just, it's just um, that I can do it, I guess.